Hey guys, welcome back um, to what I'm going to try and make a weekly vlog. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Um, today is actually Valentine's Day. I have the day off because I don't generally work on Wednesdays. I laid in bed for a lot longer than I intended to today. It's now like 2 p.m. Um, but I did lay in bed and be productive, so we made two of these red Valentine's bandanas. They're not really for Valentine's, they're just some excess red I had from the Valentine's top that I made. Um, mostly because uh, my cat has a habit of, as soon as I decide to actually get out of bed, that's when he will come over and lie on top of me and decide it's snuggle time. So uh, when he did that, we decided to crochet instead so we could still be kind of productive. I've read some, some things today. I ordered my coffee. I'm an adult and we are downsizing to a medium instead of a large all the time. It's Valentine's Day, I'm gonna do what I want, so I've ordered a burrito bowl, we are eating that, and then we are going to continue making bandanas, I think, because I've got a plethora of cotton yarn um, that I think will make really cute bandanas, and I'm in a bandana mood. I don't want to focus on stitch counts right now, uh, but I still want to be productive. So I'm gonna eat my burrito bowl not not on camera and then we'll be back right I forgot I was doing this oh. <clears throat> so obviously finished burrito bowl I'm actually almost out of coffee now which is fine because I had to get up and make my pre-workout but I just watched upgraded it was actually a really good movie it's got Camilla in it she's great um so we've made this bandana. It's really pretty. And I've almost finished the main chunk of a second bandana. Um, and then I will obviously have to add the straps to these. Um, but I'm kind of hoping that I can get them both completely finished before I go to the gym. Uh, we have class at 5.30. It's 4 o'clock now. So I probably have about half an hour before I actually have to like get ready to go. Because of course the gym is across town because the gym is closer to work than it is to home but whatever that's fine um yeah and then after the gym i'm gonna have to come back here take some photos oh goodness i'm tired take some photos of the bandanas i've made today and the other bandanas that i have so i can post them and then i do have a project for work that i need to do so i will probably clear off my sewing desk that's covered in a mountain of yarn um, and do that sewing project because I kind of need to take it back because when I return that project to work it will give me store credit and I can buy more yarn or a new shelf because I am getting another one of this bookshelf to add to go further that way um, yeah so I'm going to pick something else to watch for the next half hour try to finish this bandana and maybe I'll get the straps put on both of them I'll see you when I get ready for the gym okay so we got the straps on this one this one is done except for the strappies. We've gotten changed. We are ready for the gym. We've got our sneakers on. We got the high ponytail. We'll turn this into a bun when we get there because you don't lift weights with a ponytail because your hair can go and like murder you. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna go make my pre-workout and then pop outside and wait for my ride because my gym buddy's come to get me.
gonna look ridiculous because of my bum. But yes, yeah, so we finished our second one today. So we have these two purple ones. Also, here's the two red ones from earlier. We will add them to the stack of five others that I have from the other day. I have Tilly and Nico. Nico is self-petting himself on the camera. So I have these four. These are the Queensland Collection Coastal Cotton Ocean Mist. Um, and I now have these four other colors. So the first one I did was Surfer's Paradise. That's called Surfer's Paradise. We have Mermaid Beach. It's like pink tones. Sunrise Beach. Like orange tones. And then these two are probably my favorite. This is the Green's Pool, which is like very greeny, yellowy. And then the Shark Island, which is like bluey teals. Um, I think I've already got some greens, so I think I'm gonna go with the blues. Yeah, I think we'll do the blues, and we'll do two more bandanas. Um, and then I think I'm gonna have to swap over to do my sewing project because it's just gonna back on the floor staring at me. I do need to work on that. Um, first, let's get the. Mm. I'm pants at finding the actual proper center pole. That's fine. Ah, there we are. Found it! So now we're just gonna start another granny square. Granny triangle? Granny bandana. Granny Bandini. So the particular pattern that I'm following is actually the bandana pattern from Passionate Kelsey on YouTube. Um, super simple. She's got a wonderful tutorial on how to make it. Um, and I'm just in bandana mode, which is why that's what we're doing. Um, but if you can do a granny square, you can make this bandana. up pretty quickly. I should actually time myself. It's what, 6.43? 6.43 right now? So I'll say we started this at 6.40 and we will see what time it is when we come back with a finished bandana. We're starting. Alright, we have finished this bandana. I really like the color of this one. Like, it's super cute. It's very blues. Very calming. I will never understand why I can do 85 chains on one side and 85 chains on the other side, and they never match up, so I always have to remove some. Uh, but we are done this one. It is now 726. So, yeah, 40, 40 minutes. I want to say it was like 640 when we started. So, about 40 minutes. I mean, not the fastest thing in the world, but not horrible. Um, which means I think I have time. I'm gonna do the second one from this skein because I can get two from a skein, and then we will swap over to the sewing half of the party. Um, this one might take me a little longer because I think I'm gonna have a snack while I do it because I've got myself some hell of good and some chips. Not that that's a great thing to be shoving into my face after the gym, but whatever, that's fine. We're just gonna enjoy life today. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna eat some snacks and make the second bandana and I'll be back. Okay, so I finished the second bandana. It's now 8.36. Um, I definitely got a little lazy. That one took a bit longer because I was eating and, you know, breaks. So, we'll add those two bandanas to the pile. They do turn out really cute. I'm a little sad that I only get two per skein of yarn, but that's fine. Realized I have this Kobo. Um, this one's cotton, bamboo. What are you? What are you made of? What are you made of? Oh, a cotton, yeah, a cotton and bamboo blend. Um, so I'm gonna add this to the pile to turn into bandanas because I don't, I don't quite think there's enough here for a top in one ball, and I only have one ball, so this should get me two bandanas in a nice neutral tone. But 
set that aside for afterwards because I'm gonna give my wrist a break and I'm gonna cut out the pattern pieces for this project. I'm making this jacket here, but we're adding bunny ears because it's the Easter season. Um, I'll show you the fabric we're using for it when we go to cut that, but I'm gonna sit here and watch some stuff while I cut the pattern pieces out of the pattern paper. Um, Cause that always takes me a while. I kind of need to do that before I can cut the fabric. And then before I can cut the fabric, I'm gonna have to clean the pile of yarn off of my desk too. Um, not that I have anywhere to put that because um, you probably can't tell that this mountain behind me is actually um, like to the floor under here. That's just more yarn. Um, I have more yarn than I have shelf space right now, which is fine because um, I'm not gonna get two more of these shelves. That's fine. Anyway, um, I'm gonna start snipping this stuff and then I'll be I'll be back later. Man. All right, this is a wholly unflattering angle, but this is probably the best way I'm gonna do this. Um, don't judge me, I cut my fabric pieces out of my floor, but you didn't hear that, that's the pattern pieces. Uh, there are only three pattern pieces I will be using. Um, we will be cutting out five pieces total of each fabric, because we have the two front sides, the back, and the two hood pieces. Obviously out of the main fabric with this, just this very Eastery cute um, mint purple and blue minky um, and then same thing out of this knit this is a tie-dye knit it's purple blue and it's got a lot more yellow in it um, made me think of Easter eggs and dyeing Easter eggs um, so we're gonna cut those pieces out and then I'm gonna I'm gonna wing it um, for the ears because I am adding bunny ears to this pattern um, I haven't quite decided how I'm adding them yet but we are adding them uh, yeah well here you go Oh. How you doing, bud? You visiting? He likes minky fabric, so I'm gonna cut these out and then get started because this should not take very long. Although cutting the minky is probably gonna be a pain in the butt. This is why I don't use minky. in the morning so I'm gonna go to bed now um, see you guys tomorrow maybe all right it is eight o'clock at night I went to work I went to the gym um, Pilates is a little harder than I thought um, not that I couldn't do it but my body is achy and my legs are a little wibbly wobbly but I'm gonna try these these loaded taco Quest chips. Um, Quest makes protein chips and they're actually really yummy. But I haven't tried the lo loaded taco yet. So we're gonna try those. Um, and then we're gonna start, I think, a new crochet project. <laughs> Big surprise! But I got the yarn and the beads for a new crochet top that I wanna try out. So I think we're gonna do that instead of working on the sweater that I'm in the middle of because I need I need a sweater break I don't know I might work on the sweater instead because the sweater is a little chunkier I haven't decided yet but I'm definitely gonna eat these chips and figure out what I want to have for dinner and I would really like to go inside now but the dog is not done outside we're inside so these are the are the loaded taco there's 19 grams of protein in this bag which is nice because I there's no way in heck I ever get the amount of protein I need in my diet um, and they don't taste like a loaded taco so much as they taste like taco dip minus the sour cream. Taco dip minus sour cream. Oh, I bet you these would be really good dipped in sour cream. I wish I had sour cream now. Um, let's brush my fingers off. So, I picked up the Kobo in this really, really pretty color right here. Um, this is... Lichen, 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 Um, okay, okay, continue, and then, oh god, oh god, stop. Nico, why are you, don't 
don't mind the situation here. Um, so we're gonna go and we're gonna this top, this this mermaid top right here. Sorry, my ring light does not want me to show you that. Um, um, but yeah, so we're going to attempt that. It's gonna be interesting because I literally just have that image. I don't have any other information or pat written pattern or anything, so. I don't know. I also don't have uh, bra cups to like stitch the inside, but I'm I'm okay with it then. We're gonna we're gonna skip that. I can always put them in later. Um, but I think that's what we're gonna work on. However, I do have enough of this beige of the Kobo to make another bandana. So I will make the bandana first. Because we are waiting for dinner to arrive. So I should be able to get a bandana done um, before dinner gets here. And then I'll eat and then I will start the mermaid top. Um, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. I haven't decided what I'm gonna watch. I might just put The Walking Dead back on because I did restart The Walking Dead, so I might put that on. I might find a feel-good movie. I don't, I don't really know, but we're gonna go crush. Good morning, um, I am a mess. So I ate last night and then I may have doom scrolled on TikTok until about 12.30 in the morning by accident, so I did not make anything. Uh, so now we are about to get our Starbucks and then we go to work for our normal nine to five, um, which is a nine to four today. <sighs> and then we'll see what happens after we leave. I don't know what I want to work on today. Hi, we are home from work. I forgot to purchase the fabric I had cut today, so I'll have to buy that tomorrow. But I did go to the mall because um, it's kind of on my way home and it's payday. So I was like, oh. I'll go in and I'll see if there's any new workout gear that I like. Um, so I treated myself to a new workout set um, from Urban Planet. So we've got this cute little dusty purple set with a little, little sports bra. And we actually went out of our comfort zone and we got the shorts. They have pockets though, so that wins. Um, me like $19 for the set because everything was buy one get one half off so it was a really good deal and I do actually very much like the Urban Plan Out Plan Out Plan Out workout gear um, and of course I was in the mall and I was walking past Sephora um, and it was fairly dead thank goodness because oh my god fuck this Sephora kids okay. thing um, so I went in because I do need a new mascara because Two of mine have like dried out and I feel like, you yeah, know, two of them have dried out and the one remaining one that I have is actually brown um, because I picked it up on the way to an event um, and didn't notice that I bought brown. So that's for like lazy, lazy days where I don't want to look like I have any makeup on, but I want lashes. I'll just throw that on. However, I've seen some really good reviews. So I treated myself and I got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lash Sculpt um, Mascara. This is black, right? This better be black. If this isn't black, I'm gonna cry. I'm pretty sure it's black. It's Sephora, so if it's not, I can take it back. They won't care. Um, but yeah, it's the first, it's the first high-end makeup product I've bought in a while. Like to the point where like my Sephora account almost didn't think I existed anymore. So I got that, and then I discovered. There's a mini so in the mall by my work now. Um, there didn't used to be. It used to be only in the mall at the north end of town. Um, but you know, there's there's a new mini so. So I got I got a few things. Now that means I um, accidentally spent fifty dollars. But I did. I needed cotton pads for my toner. Um, so I got this cute little cinema roll one. So I've got a nice container that closes and seals. What are you doing? Stop self-heading yourself on the camera. Nico, jeez. And then I went on a bit of like a health and well, not a health thing, but like a little bit of a beauty splurge. So found this um, nourishing hand avocado mask. So I thought I'd try that because my hands are garbage right now because it's winter in Canada. 
And I got a couple of face masks. I got a seaweed one and a rice one. Not that I don't have a million sheet masks in my house. Um, these were just really adorable, so I figured I'd try them. Um, the Karomi one is a cleansing bamboo charcoal clay mask, and then the Cinema Roll one is a moisturizing hyaluronic acid cream facial mask. They were really cute. I thought I'd try them. They were like two and a half bucks a piece. And then I was in like the lunchbox section and they had a lot of really cute bags. And this is not a lunch bag, but I'm going to use it as a lunch bag. So for this little mesh cinema roll bag, it's really cute. It's a good lunch size and it's got a little front pocket. So I got that and to go with it to match myself lunchbox cutlery there's a little fork and a little spoon and they've got cinnamon roll on them um clearly i'm a child at heart <laughs> so i have those because i want to try to start actually taking food with me to work and in order to do that i need something to carry them so now i just need like cute um reusable lunch dishes so i gotta look into that and then i did stop and get myself dinner from I don't even know where this is. It's from the food court. So we've just got some chicken fried rice with, with veggies, green beans, broccoli, and whatnot. So I'm gonna eat dinner. And then I'm gonna try and actually crochet because I got distracted by TikTok last night. Um, yeah, so we'll see if I actually managed to crochet. Good morning. Um, so I started feeling not great last night, so I let myself go to bed early and I didn't really do much. Um, and then I got up this morning and realized I forgot to load money onto my bus pass. So I will be cabbing it to work today. <laughs> um, it's snowing. That's fantastic. It's very fluffy snow. It's quite cold every time it lands on my nose. But we are walking up to get coffee and then we will get a cab to work got to work and I can't just cap from home I need the coffee I need coffee hopefully today will be a good day though and hopefully I don't start feeling like garbage again like I did last night well, work's been so cold that I actually have worn gloves and my hat all day so my hair is a mess um we got other big panzerottis for dinner and probably for lunch tomorrow so I'm gonna eat that while I watch some passionate Valentine's Day vlog because I haven't watched that one yet um, and then we'll figure out what we're gonna do tonight hey, so it's about nine o'clock um, I finished some dinner um, just crochet and more bandanas because I don't really know what I want to do right now um, and we're gonna watch some <laughs> border security Australia because um, TikTok's got me really invested in <laughs> watching people freak out because um, they get checked at the border because Australia is super strict. <laughs> I don't even understand why it's so enthralling to me that uh, we're gonna crochet and watch some border security Australia. All right, so I've officially finished this ball of the Lion Brand Kobo. This is all I have left. Not enough to finish anything with, um, but I did actually get three bandanas out of it. So I have three of that nice neutral linen-y kind of colored bandana. What do they call it? Beige. Um, it's quarter after 11. I was about to say I'm not tired and then I yawned. Um, I'm not truly tired yet, so I think I'm gonna do this color of the Queensland 100% cotton. Um, and this will make two bandanas, so I know I'll make one tonight. I'm not sure if I'll finish a second one. We'll see where we get. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. I will be picked up for the gym any minute. We're gonna shove a quest bar in my face because I've basically just rolled out of bed. We're drinking some pre-workout, trying to get some hydration in there. Um, and then we're gonna go work out before I have to go to work. Bah. All right, we are at work. 
not terribly early. Um, stopped for coffee and I ordered a Simply Sausage sandwich and they actually made me two. Um, so today's a good day. Um, so I'm gonna eat that punch in and do some paperwork before the store opens. this left and I was like oh yeah I was gonna make a top with those two um no 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 um this is what I have left after I made the top so this is this is the one of the I don't remember whether this is the peekaboo or the other one but this is this is one of the bralettes um I forgot I had already made it which means this is indeed leftovers so I guess either another top or bandanas. Um, I'll probably just do bandanas because I'm on a bandana cake. Um, yeah. I, but I think I need a bandana break. Not that it's really a bandana break because um, I'm going to switch over to working on this hexi cardigan with this um, lion pride mandala. Um, and I mean, that is also just granny stitches. So, <laughs> not really that funny. Um, I had to get a container for my tiny balls of yarn. I don't know what I'm going to do with these. Um, don't know, don't know what to do them. So for now, we're just going to pop them in this container. So they don't roll all over the place because my cat's a demon. Um, and we'll figure out something to do with the little scrappy bits and bobs at a later date. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm just going to crochet a bit. Um, this hasn't really been a full week, but I think I'm just gonna do like Monday to Sunday type deals for these vloggy things um, that I'm gonna attempt to continue doing. So I'm gonna end this one here and I will see you guys in the next one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go crochet and be lazy. Good morning. 